could unfold our academic life with these outstanding contributions to education and science and the publication research. Research is passion. While coming, I will say that I was talking to him and it's a great privilege for me and honor for me to spend so much time with him. And it is a, I, I hope that Professor Rao will be remembering. He gave the compositional address in IIT Kanpur and I went, he was going to Pune, going up there, Lucknow Airport, I accompanied him. There was a long association with him for so many hours I spent and today also. And in the process, while talking, you learn hundred things. You will be surprised to know that Professor Rao had his first publication in the year 1954. So just imagine. And this year is 2013. How many papers he has published? You know that, and I will be also reading out the citation. How many books he has edited and written, even now, unbelievable. We talk about that research output in terms of each index. That is the not only the buzzword, the index parameter by which you know how you perform, how you have performed so far in academics. You will be happy to know that his H index is not some, some number like most of us were having. His H index is 108, 148, unbelievable. Outstanding personality. His number of citations last year, this year also, close to 5,000, precisely 4,000, not 6,700. Close to 5,000. So you can imagine in one year a person can get that many number of citations. So what is his contribution in science? And he is the creator, and all of us, all the five ISERs, and the students, community, faculty members, we will feel grateful, we are privileged, or honored that we got an opportunity to serve institutes like ISERs. And it is the his grandchild. He convinced the government and government will not question him when he suggests something and that's what will happen. So the system was set in place, system started functioning and he always says that he has a hope and I hope that all of us we should keep that in mind. There one day quality science, we have started doing all the answer system, maybe one day we will be there that ISER will be showing the leadership in science in this country, which the initiation has already started. There is a huge hope, and that is the hope Professor Rao always thinks about. His passion, you spend some time with him, you know what kind of person he is, and too small a person to talk about his contribution to science. And if you know, most of us, you have heard from me also, we talk about IIT Kanpur and all these other institutes, ISC Bangalore. I happen to be in one of those institutes, IIT Kanpur. That department, the teaching, the quality of teaching and the research contributions, what to do in chemistry, modern day chemistry, not the old type, the alchemy chemistry type. You know, it was the creation and the leadership of Professor John, hey, Professor Rao. Professor Rao was supported by absolutely fantastic professors there, and a galaxy of people who made that department and all of it here. And he, one day, he had to go and that is the way things are always in science. I won't say much about that, but I must admit that that Pfizer Kolkata started in 2006. It suffered a little bit early days because the campus, but then we came here, and this year on 8th of July, we had our first convocation. And it is extremely a good note that we started our convocation conferring honorary partial doctor of philosophy degree, science degree to Dr. C. M. Rao. No one can think of another name when Dr. Rao's name is there. That day, we had three batches, I was telling him 2006, 2007, and 2008. Batch of Isaac Bhagavatas got their degrees and we conferred in his absence because that very time he had to go to Singapore to attend the international conference so he could not come. So, but still today to keep the thread intact so that you know exactly why he was here today, I should read out the citation which will which be presented today and which was read already.
Professor Rao, born on June 30, 1934 in Bangalore. Professor Rao obtained his MSc and PhD degrees from Banaras Hindu University in 1953 and Purdue University PhD in 1958. Professor Rao has held faculty positions at the Indian Institute of Technology, Kanpur, and Indian Institute of Science, IIC Bangalore. He was the director of IIC Bangalore during 1984 to 1994 and the founding president of the Jawaharlal Nehru Center for Advanced Scientific Research, which we call JNCAS or Bangalore. Professor Rao is presently the National Research Professor as well as Honorary President, Alana Spaulding Research Professor at the JNCAS. He is also an Honorary Professor at the IMC and is the Chairman, Scientific Advisory Council to the Prime Minister of India. Professor Rao is one of the most inspiring scientists of the country and is a role model to many, with his relentless drive and commitment to science and contributions to capacity building and science education. His main research interests are in solid state and materials chemistry, to which areas he made pioneering contributions. He has authored, you know what still I am saying, over 1500 research papers and 45 books. The number must have increased by now. Professor Rao has received honorary doctorates from 54 universities, and I am told even more. National and international universities, I name a few, Bangladesh, Bordeaux, Colorado, Delhi, Hyderabad, IIT, Bombay, IIT, Karakpur, Liverpool, Northwestern, Oxford, Purdue, Stellenbosch, Wales, and to name a few. Professor Rao has been the recipient of various prestigious medals, awards, and fellowships. The Marlowe Medal of the Canadian Society, which he got, received in 1967, Bhattana Prize in 1968, Jawaharlal Nehru Fellowship in 1973, Centennial Foreign Fellowship of the American Chemical Society in 1976, Royal Society of Chemistry London Medal in 1981, Herovsky Gold Medal of the Czechoslovak Academy in 1989, Einstein Gold Medal of UNESCO in 1996, and the Order of Scientific Merit Grand, Grand Cross from the University from the President of Brazil in 2002. He received the Daniel Hitt Prize in 2005 for science in the future dimension for his research in material science. He was named Chemical Pioneer by the American Institute of Chemistry in 2005. And Chevalier de la Dale Legion del Honor by the President of the French Republic 2005. He also received the honorary fellowship of the Institute of Physics, London in 2006, and honorary fellowship of St. Catherine's College, Oxford, 2007. He was awarded the Royal Medal, the Queen's Medal, by the Royal Society in UK in 2009. And the honors William for, for Hoffman Medal for his outstanding contributions to chemistry by the German Chemical Society in 2010. He received the Ernesto Eli Test Science Prize for Materials Research in 2011. Recently, the Chinese Academy of Sciences gave his top science award, award for international scientific cooperation in 2012 to for his important contributions in boosting China-India scientific cooperation. Professor Lau has been instrumental in the creation of ICERs, as I already mentioned, and in designing ICERs policy guidelines. Professor Rao was awarded the Padma Shri in 1974, Padma Vibhushan in 1985. He became the first recipient of the India Science Award in 2004 for his contributions to solid state chemistry and material science. Professor Rao is the founder president of both the Chemical Research Society of India and of the Material Research Society of India. He was the president of the Indian National Science Academy during 85-86, the Indian Academy of Sciences 89-91, the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry 85-97, and the Indian Science Founders Association during 87-88. He was an Albert Einstein research professor 95-99. He also created the Siena Rao Education Foundation from a part of the Million Dollar Dan David Award from Tel Aviv University, Israel. 
to encourage brilliant young students to pursue science from a young age. It is both an honor and a privilege to confer upon Prof. C. N. R. Rao the degree of Doctor of Science honorary person on this day, I quote that day, 8th of July 2013. Please give a big hand for the